Hello YouTube, welcome back to my channel and in this video I'm recording with the brand new Xiaomi Mi 5S Plus. This is the flagship phone from Xiaomi released uh, just last month and luckily I was able to get hold of one uh, from Brandon. So thanks to Brandon once again for providing me with the unit. Uh, I'm recording as you can see with the front facing camera. It has a 4 megapixel ultra pixel sensor, a same sensor used in many uh, HTC flagship phones. So hopefully you'll be getting some good decent video quality. By the way I'm recording at full HD 1080p uh, at 30 frames per second. That's what the camera can record max up to. The two back cameras at the back, both are 30 megapixel, also with f2.0 aperture, same as the one on the front. So quite a wide aperture. Uh, so we should be able to getting we should be getting some um, a good decent photo and video quality. I'm yet to upload the samples from the phone. The phone can record also up to 4K. So in the next coming days, guys, hopefully I should be able to upload some video samples, and we'll also be testing the auto focusing capabilities of the phone, and we'll see how the camera modules are like. Overall, I've been uh, impressed with the performance so far. It has Snapdragon 821 along with 4 gigs of RAM and 64 gig of internal storage. Uh, as you guys know, there's a 6 gig of variant as well, which has 128 gigs of internal storage. But uh, so far, I've been happy with the 4 gig variant. It's powerful enough. It's got plenty of poke in it. Uh, yesterday, as you guys know, I did a gaming performance video on my channel and I was uh, very impressed. It was good, smooth performance, uh, no drop in frame rates, and overall it was a nice, pleasurable experience. And the good thing was that the Snap Snapdragon 821 did not heat at all. Uh, th thanks to Xiaomi's um, optimizations and Qualcomm's uh, optimizations, uh, the Snapdragon 821 seems to be really, really cool. In fact, super cool. It never went beyond 37, 38. Despite me gaming for over an hour, the phone stayed super cool, which is good. So if you're a gamer and looking to buy the Xiaomi Mi 5S Plus with its top in specs, Snapdragon 821, I'm sure you won't be disappointed. And there wouldn't be any title on the Play Store which this phone cannot handle. It's early in the morning in London, guys, going to work. So uh, I thought, let me just do a quick video, uh, front-facing camera, and yet another car vlog to show you guys what the camera on the phone's like. Uh, I will be uploading, like I said, a few samples from the back camera, uh, hopefully soon in the next coming days, so I will keep you informed. Uh, battery life has been very impressive. A 3,800 mAh battery for a 5.7-inch Full HD 1080p panel. Uh, so obviously, uh, you, we do expect long battery life, but the battery life has been very, very long. Exceptionally long. And in the next few days to come, you will see the battery performance video, which I'll be uploading. I'm uh, collecting my stats and data at the moment. And we are talking of over six hours of screen on time. I don't want to discuss it too much right now because otherwise it will just uh, kill all the, you know, um, the wait for the uh, for the battery performance video. So I'll definitely do that once that is ready. Uh, but in general, I've been overall impressed with the phone. It's got a very good, nice metal uh, uh, aluminium construction, a decent pair of cameras. I'm 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 hope that uh, that front facing camera is also giving you a good video quality, and you can hear me clearly as well at the same time. And the phone has fast charging, which I really love. Uh, in just under an hour and a half, you can uh, charge the phone fully from, I think, around 20%, 30%, which is not too bad. Very, very nice. But in general, the f I'm, I'm impressed with the phone so far. I think they've done well, Xiaomi. And uh, keeping in mind the price of the phone, I think it's definitely um, a value for money. Probably the cheapest uh, Snapdragon 821 money can buy, 8 Dragon 21 base chips, or sorry, money can buy. Uh, the Xiaomi Mi 5S obviously is cheaper because it's a smaller phone, but uh, in the big screen, um, you know, category, uh, up to 5.7 inch screen, uh, this is probably the cheapest phone you will buy for top end specs, so not too bad. So guys, this was a quick video uh, showing you um, uh, the front facing camera on the Xiaomi Mi 5S Plus. Uh, if you got any questions, please feel free to ask me in the comment section. And if you like my video, please do give it a thumbs up, guys. And like always, please subscribe as it helps. And I shall see you in the next video.